Hey guys, uh, Han here from the from the Outcasts. So yeah, I just wanted to do, introduce myself. In a minute, we're a three-man team: uh, myself, uh, Mark, uh, and Stevo. Uh, we're doing our first vision competition at the Amatola Bass Classic in two weeks' time. So basically, yeah, in two weeks' time, we will be on the water for a few hours, uh, hopefully with a few decent-sized bass in the boat already. Um, but yeah, I just want to quickly take this opportunity to thank our, our sponsors, uh, Match Projects, uh, Flare, and Corsi Young Properties, Togo Engineering, uh, The Queen and Peasant, and then also El Dorado Blue Star. Uh, I'll probably give a bit more detail in, in, in the description below about all these, all these amazing sponsors. So, big thanks to you guys. You deserve a fist bump. That'll come at the end of the video. So, um, thanks to these sponsors, we managed to get a few... Uh, like lures, I mean they paid for our helping our pay for our accommodation, for our petrol, our boat petrol, um, I said food, camp costs, all these all these good things. A lot of lures. So I thought it'd be a cool opportunity to to just take you through our box of lures that we got from Bass.0.z. So big thanks to Shaul and uh, Steve and JJ and the team for, for making this possible. So ooh, very excited to, to have a look in here. So, firstly we've got some uh, U2 uh, Pro Formula Live Hole Treatment. I mean, just to make sure our fishies are nice and, and healthy. I mean, if that guy recommends it, and Shaul and Steve recommend it, then yeah, I'm going to believe them. Um, this is the Big Bite Baits um, 3.5 inch cane thumpers. Yeah, three and a half inch candomas is the hematoma color. So yeah, it's got a beautiful black blue presentation. So we'll see if that works. I'm just gonna grab and go mad in the bag. So I'm not, there's no specific order or fashion. Um, Marky got some June bug. It's like a, a fluke, a, a worm and a lizard. So he got a few of those. He's also got the normal watermelon color. Um, these are quite unique for the backstabber lure. So yeah, it's got a little treble hook on the, on the back of the, of the lure. Let's see if it's in focus. Yeah, so it's... Um, then Mark and Steve got two of these uh, bluegill slash perch uh, chatterbaits. So they look a bit more bluegill than, than perch to me. So very, very pretty chatterbait. This is for me the most beautiful lure that I've seen in a long time. It's the striking, uh, also the red eye shad, but it's a neon blue gill color. It's just such a stunning bait, and this was uh, one that Steve O picked, so I'm sure it's going to provide some results. Um, then I went a bit crazy with with jigs. Got a few T Man uh, black blue jigs. Um, a green jig, another backstabber, uh, but more in a pink presentation. Marcus got a, uh, a spinner bait. You can see it's got a little bit of white, black, um, a chartreuse, and then also a copper blade. We heard that spinner baits do quite well there. Then this is quite a unique. This is for some of my jigs. This is a uh, chocolate orange uh, crawl. I mean, those little pinches look so realistic, and it's from uh, Gary Yamamoto, the man, the man, the man. Uh, then these are the Smoky Ghost cane thumpers for our jigs. I mean, Roar's Fighting Frog, it's one of the best baits. I uh, love it. This is the black neon, so there's little more red flakes uh, in between the black. This is the Big Boat Baits Cane Thumper Easy Money. It's got such a unique color. It's got a bit of a bluegill uh, color, so that's also for, for jigs. Then, um, with all my jigs, more jigs, white, and these are little finesse jigs, um, I got quite a few uh, trailers. So, yeah, I've got a, a green. Uh, like with a chartreuse swirl in there, like a like a green, it's like a candy color flake, white, 
black blue, you can never go wrong with black blue and, and murky water. Uh, and then, yeah, just some like a bit of a red color. Um, and these are quite unique as well. It's the Big Bite Bait Squirrel Tail, all in black. I'm a big fan of the normal, like the traditional squirrel tail, where it's like brown with the PLA tail. So the, the pure black, I'm sure it's gonna work quite nicely as well. You can never leave home without uh, Kamagatsu hooks. This is quite a beautiful one as well. It's the uh, striking uh, bleeding gill uh, red eye shad. So yeah, this looks very pretty. I think Marcus got that one. And then Steve got the KVD square ball crank. Uh, it's such a pretty lure as well. Um, such a tiny presentation. Um, and then, yeah, one of my favorites is this Coppers or Coppers or whatever live target baby bass. It's just got such an amazing detail um, in here about this little bass. So yeah, quite keen to try it out as a little bit of a jerk or a, as a, a little bit of a crankbait. And then also, we just got a few uh, little bullet weights. Um, I mean, tungsten's amazing, but yeah, just when the tungsten's run out, it gets quite pricey and expensive. So yeah, we got a few spares. I dropped something earlier, and it's the just a little bit of a peanut butter. Uh, color jig, it's the only thing I can call it. And then another uh, June bag for Marcus. So you can see we got our cool caps made for us. Let me know in the comment section below if you would be interested in uh, in purchasing one of these caps. We're gonna maybe print a few of them uh, and send, do a little giveaway um, in the next few weeks after, after the Bass Classic. So I hope you enjoyed this unboxing. Um, I mean, we're really excited to, to get out onto the water. I've uh, got a few things to do still. Um, but overall, I think we're quite well prepared for, for this event and we're just looking forward to, to having a good time and, and just keep fishing um, and just doing this for fun. Um, so yeah, yet again, thanks to our sponsors, thanks for the people watching, thanks for, for all the organizers and all the people that pulled together to, to, to help us uh, get to this point. So for that, you deserve a fist bump. Boop.